The Environmental and Climate Justice Clinic is focused on environmental harms that disproportionately face low-income communities, and particularly low-income communities of color. So our clinic is examining how climate change affects and makes those communities more vulnerable and how those communities can draw on their inherent strengths to address climate challenges and other environmental justice challenges. I really was drawn to this clinic um, and I think it's special because it focuses on a different type of lawyering which is um, transactional. The typical legal skills that students develop are case planning and teamwork, um, client counseling skills, so direct kind of communication with your client, drafting, they write a lot. We do our own research, we set our own agenda, and we tell Professor uh, Penu what we need. I'm trying to help them understand how do you counsel community groups, how do you work in an embedded community, um, how do you work in partnership with people. We talk about community lawyering and environmental justice lawyering. We talk about business law, like basic practical kind of skills. And then we also talk about energy law because energy is a huge factor in our climate policy. A lot of what we're doing is trying to figure out how to do client-based counseling in a field that is historically very litigation focused. We sometimes represent individuals, but we primarily represent community groups and we usually represent neighborhoods, which I think is really interesting. We're essentially serving our clients. We're here to essentially empower them to, to lead themselves and we want our clients to use us as the tools that will allow them to bridge whatever legal gaps that they, they need. So that might be trying to implement solar power or have more environmentally sustainable buildings. We're also working with a community trying to transform their waterfront. And because we're representing a, a, like a physical place, the responsibilities are a little bit different than if you were representing just an individual, and oftentimes a lot harder. The work that I do in the clinic is really immediately tied into the community's outcome, the community's future. Um, and so just knowing that I'm making that kind of real world impact is really satisfying. Anyone who wants to see how transactional law issues play out in the real world um, and to employ them um, in real ways to help real communities, this clinic would uh, really be enjoyable to them. All lawyers at some point are going to practice like transactional regulatory litigation or, or statutory policy making kind of law or engage in strategic research and media advocacy and our clinic does all those things. Being able to do that early on in your, in your career and have somebody to guide you through these issues uh, is something that everybody should, should experience.